since I was a kid, I've read so much more now. So many people have written about that. I made a documentary on it. I did what you're doing. I interviewed lots and lots of people. So my, my knowledge of it now is different than what it was then. And I, I'm trying to think back to how much did I know then. What I think is that um, when they ended up buying RKO Studio and turning it into Desilu, I, I was, you know, six, something like that, about around that age. And I just thought it was the coolest thing ever that suddenly mom and dad owned, they, they actually said they owned this whole place. So if I wanted to go to the prop department and just fool around for an hour and a half, I could. Like the guy would say, oh yeah, come on in, Lucy. Come on in, little Desi. Come on in. And they just go let us play with King Kong and all those amazing things that were in there. And it was magical, magical. And I mean, we had that little go-karts and so you could go all around with dad, all in the back lot, you know, where they filmed, and he had three studios. They, they owned Culver City and, and um, General Service and this one and the Coenga lot and the, that lot, oh, where they filmed Gone with the Wind and you know, it was pretty amazing. Was your mother very involved in the business side? No, God no, she hated the business side. She gets a lot of credit for having run, a, for first woman to run a studio, hated that whole thing, hated it. Just wanted to be Lucy, just wanted to do her show and not be worried about any of that business stuff. That was Desi's, that was my father's, you know, domain. And when it didn't work out that he was going to leave and she had to buy him out, she kept all the same people that he had hired, brilliant people, and, um, and took their advice for the most part. She relied on them as well she should. Made a couple of pretty good decisions on her own just by the seat of her pants. Like, no, let's not cancel Star Trek. I like that. I don't, I don't care if it's expensive or Mission Impossible, you know. Um, the, the, she had good instincts, but she really didn't enjoy the day-to-day -day business part of it at all. 